Hello everyone, welcome to today's tutorial. Well, today I was transforming for you guys again and it's quite obvious that I'm Tinkerbell today, so have fun with the video. We'll start with a foundation. I'll use the matting foundation from Le Ambre Cosmetics and I will apply it with a little sponge. For setting this foundation up, I'll use the Blood Powder by MAC in the color Medium. As a blush, I use the MAC Mocha Matcha blush, which is a, a matte um, blush and I'm going to apply it especially on the apples because I'm going to look cute like a little fairy. This is the um, eyebrow liner I'm going to use, but first I need to snuggle with my puppy. And then I apply the eyeliner by Essence, it's in the shade Blonde. Then I set my eyebrows with the Transparence Mascara by the brand Essence. This is, by the way, if you're not from Europe, a local um, franchise, drugstore's um, own brand. Not expensive, a really good one. And as, a, yeah, as an eyeshadow base, I use the Shadow Insurance by Too Faced. This is the palette I'm going to work today with. This is by the brand IQ Cosmetics. Here you can see an overview of the colors. And I will start with the light golden one. eye crease and in the outer corners of my upper lids I will use this peach colored ones and later I'm going to mix it with another color. Now I use this brown shade with violet undertone. And I'm going to be blending it in immediately with the orange shade. After transitions I use the Essence blending brush and then I take the Glide On Pencil by Urban Decay in the shade Brown. I will paint uh, on the outer corner of my lower lids and I'm going to make a shape of the line for my eyeliner I'm going to apply now. It's the Cake Eyeliner by the brand Cryolan. I'm going to mix it with the sealer and apply it with a flat angled brush. to a bit changing my shape of my eyes because a Tinkerbell's eyes are very almond shaped so that's what I'm trying to do here. the eyeline appears softer I use a little bit of the matte black eyeshadow and put it over the entire eyeline on my upper lid. For my upper lashes I will use the mascara by Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara and for the lower lids just a brown shade by Yves Rocher.
So this Soft Sensation Lip Color Butter by Astor in the shade 020 Flirt Natural is the color I'm going to use for my lips because it's a natural, beautiful reddish shape with a little bit peach undertone. And then let's start with the hair. I'm going to separate a little section in the front because that's gonna be my fourth bangs. And first I'm going to make a high set ponytail. I teased a little bit the front section and I'm going to shape it with my fingers uh, over my forehead so that it looks like or very similar like, a, uh, like the bangs that Tinkerbell has. I pull the hair to the back and wrap it around the elastics of my ponytail and secure it with a pin. And I use this thing I'm about, I have no idea how is it called, to create my Tinkerbell bun. I'll shape it with my fingers so it looks kind of even and then I secure it again on several places with bobby pins and I will add light green ribbon which I tie in uh, as a bow in the front and I put it a little bit on the side. And here are a few details for you guys. This is the makeup and the hair. I found those earrings in a store called Bijou Brigitte. I think they're very cute in the light green flower shape. And that's it for the makeup and for the hair first. So, and now we need a costume. So I made this costume myself and in a few days I'm going to edit the videos where I'm going to show you how I make the wings and the shirt and the skirt. I just love Disney and any Disney figure is just fun for me. I hope you enjoy those videos too. And if yes, if you like this video, don't forget to leave a comment or a thumb up. If you're new here, welcome. I would be happy if you would come back again. Even um, if you're new here and you don't know what's happening here, the best way is to look at my playlists. There are divided by uh, several themes and I would love to welcome everyone on my Facebook and Instagram page. Links are in the info below the video and thank you so so much for watching. Uh, in the next day I'm gonna show you how to create wings like that and how I've made the costume. So I'm gonna be editing these videos um, over weekend and I should be able to post the video next week, Thursday, Friday. So I'm gonna try to do my best so that it's here as fast as possible because this is self-made. And thank you so much and have a great day and I'm looking forward to seeing you with the next video. Bye!